loves welcome or welcome back to my channel this is christina and i have a quick word from the lord so this word is coming from a vision i had last night in this vision there was a bunch of people standing up males and females and everyone was looking down at the ground and just in that moment everyone's head just started to rise and like as their heads rose I could just see the eyes of everyone and their eyes just went like straight to the sky and for some reason the eyes stood out to me like just the motion of their eyes just how you know focused I was on the faces of these people when they lifted their heads from looking down to looking up and I got super excited when the Lord gave me that vision asked him for revelation and what it meant and immediately he brought to me psalms 121 verses 1 through 1 and it reads i lift up my eyes to the hills where does my help come from my help comes from the lord the maker of heaven and earth so what the lord ministered to me through this vision is that there are many of you right now with your heads held down there are many of you feeling discouraged there's many of you feeling just tired and weary in this time and trust me i am right there with you I am right there. I am pretty sure I was one of those people stood up in that crowd. You know, it's been a long, long season, but the Lord is telling you today to lift up your eyes to the hills because that is where your help comes from. Your help comes from him. So when I woke up this morning um, and I asked the Lord if there was anything he wanted me to share, that vision came back to me immediately. Like I remembered it immediately. And so I was like, okay, I'll do that. Um... But then he spoke to me in a different way about the vision. He spoke to me about repentance. He reminded me of the looks on the people's faces in this vision and just how this lady in particular, she had like this kind of worrisome, kind of embarrassed kind of um, expression on her face. And he spoke to me about repentance. And guys, the Lord is saying he is still calling us to repentance. He is calling us to repentance. There are many of you that feels like what you've done is too wrong for him to forgive you. You just feel embarrassed. You feel like some of the decisions that you've made, some of the sinful decisions that you've made, you've made them knowingly. You've made them like, you know, consciously like knowing like, okay, I know this is wrong, but this is what I feel like doing. This is what I want to do. And you're embarrassed about it, but the Lord is still calling you to repentance. He also reminded me of a word he had me release back in February and it's titled prepare your hearts and minds. I will link it below. And in that word, I was sharing how I heard in a dream that dangerous times are ahead, that these are dangerous times. There are dangerous times ahead right and this has already began in the earth i've already seen like the manifestation of that word that he gave me these dangerous times have already begun and the lord is calling us to repentance because what what side are you going to be on like are you going to be on the side of his judgment or are you going to be on the side of his blessings he's giving us time to repent to come back to him and to repent you know and draw closer to him and draw nearer to him and so that that um part of the vision that he ministered to me you know was these people who are looking down who are embarrassed who feel ashamed of i guess recent decisions you know recent um situations in their lives and you know he's just he just wants to comfort you and give you that strength to lift your eyes up, to come to him in repentance, to, you know, rid you of the spirit of, of self-condemnation, you know, just so you can have that courage to come to him and to know that he will forgive you, but you have to make better decisions. You know, you can't, you can't choose to just always make the wrong decisions and fall into sin and, and not seek him for strength during these times you can't just continue to repeat the same patterns and just keep coming back to him to forgiveness he does want to strengthen us you know he's he's our strength in in our weakness right and so in those times when we have that weakness and we feel too weak to fight temptation and that sort of stuff we're supposed to seek him in those moments in those moments for the strength to resist those temptations to sin right the scripture to support this part of the word is second chronicles 7 verse 14 and it reads if my people who were called by my name will humble themselves and pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways then i will hear from heaven and i will forgive their sin and will heal their land 
This is the word, guys. Um, lift your eyes up to the hills because your help comes from the Lord. You know, those of us who are feeling tired and weary and looking around like what's what's happening lift your eyes up to him and also those of you who are feeling guilty and embarrassed and stuff come to him repent because things are changing in the earth and the lord is not playing he's not playing around but yeah guys i think that's it so i love you guys have an amazing rest of your day and god bless you i love you and jesus loves you even more bye